Hey guys, it's John P. with Geek Beat TV. We're here with our continuing coverage at CES 2014, and I'm gonna give you a full update on the MyCharge battery lineup. Welcome to Geek Beat. This episode of Geek Beat is brought to you by Toyota. So every year we like to come and visit the guys at MyCharge because they have really beautiful batteries, they work well, they're reliable, and they keep updating them every year. They're a little bit different. They keep improving things. So I'm gonna give you the updates. Uh, just I'm just randomly gonna pick them. We'll start kind of with the, with the top end of the range here. So this is a new version that's gonna be coming out. All of these are coming out maybe in the, in the uh, end of first quarter. But this is a uh, 3000 milliamp battery and it has a light, uh, lightning connector. So this is obviously an iPhone or iOS based product battery. Um, it's got a kind of a soft touch aluminum feel. It's uh, very nicely rounded, super thin and uh, I mean, just feels good in your hand. These little bad boys are gonna go for $99. It's got a uh, cover over the charger, micro USB charge, and that is the version for iOS. There's also an Android version. You'll notice it's, it's slightly larger, but they're both still very thin. This one, however, will have, a, it's got a nice little hook here. You grab that and bingo, your micro USB charger there. Again, with the soft touch kind of aluminum finish, this one is 4,000 milliamps. Um, and it also has a USB port right there and a micro USB for charging. Uh, so 99 bucks for either one of those. Oh, one thing that I forgot to mention, on all of these batteries, they are incorporating kind of a smart charger port technology. So what happens is, these USB ports are capable of putting out 2.4 volts uh, or amps, 2.4 amps, but uh, they will throttle down to whatever device you can plug it in, whatever the device you plug in can take. So if you plug in a phone that will only take a one amp charge, it drops down to that. But if you plug something in like a, an iPad that'll take 2.1, it throttles up to that. So all of them, even the inexpensive ones that I'm gonna show you, not that any of them are really expensive, now, there are also these, these versions, the super ultra thin MyCharge. This is a 3000 milliamp battery and it's gonna go for 59 bucks. It has the smart uh, port on it, but it also has a high efficiency battery inside. So that means usually there's a lot of overhead with these things. When, you, when they say it's a 2000 milliamp, let's say, you might actually get 1700 out of it. But in this case, because they're high efficiency batteries, you're gonna get the full rated uh, charge. They also have a 6,000 milliamp version. You'll notice it's just a little bit thicker. They feel really good in your hand, but this one has dual ports on it. Now it won't put out 2.4 uh, amps uh, per port, but it will put out uh, whatever it can do on a single one or divide it among the two if need be. These are gonna go for $79. Now, as we look down the range, there are other sizes as well. We've got them in the $29, $39, and $49 variants. The $29 are gonna be very basic. It's got a nice button here uh, with uh, the LED indicators. It's got a USB output on there. And uh, let's see, this one is capacity uh, 8.14 watt hours. I'm not sure exactly how many milliamps that translates to, sorry. Now when you step up to the other ones, they also add a little LED light if you see that there. So you can, you can have a battery uh, with a light to stick in your pocket. They feel really good, they're super nice. We, we, we find that the MyCharge batteries are high quality units. Like I said, availability to be towards the end of the first quarter. We'll let you know when they come out and that's it from the My Charge booth. Hey, thanks so much to our sponsors for helping us make this CES coverage available. And I'm John P. We'll be back with more. Stay tuned on youtube.com forward slash geekbeatv and geekbeat.tv forward slash CES live. See you guys.
Thanks again to Toyota for sponsoring our CES coverage. Hey guys, thanks for watching all of our CES coverage here live in Las Vegas. We hope you're enjoying it. And if you are, please consider becoming a patron of the arts of GeekBeat. It's expensive to make this stuff. Look at everything. That is true. Did you know that you can actually pledge just even a few bucks a month to help us keep doing all of this coverage and bringing you this wonderful content? We Every love it. dollar counts and we appreciate all of the amounts and at different levels you can get cool, geeky stuff depending yeah. on what the level is that you choose. You know, we have levels that include like t-shirts every few months, the Geek Beat t-shirts. We have levels that include gadgets every few months. Like a gadget package in the mail every three or six months. Oh, wow. Personally selected by us. Yep. All right, so go to geekbeat.tv slash patrons if that sounds interesting to you. And of course, if you enjoy what we do. And thank you to all of you who have already pledged. Yes. We'll see you later. Bye.